Well, happening today, Senator Richard Blumenthal wants stronger consequences for NFL players involved in domestic violence. He's calling on the NFL to hold them accountable. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Caitlin Nuclo is live this morning at the Legislative Office Building in Hartford, where Blumenthal will be meeting with domestic violence advocates today. Caitlin? And Blumenthal says if the NFL doesn't take action soon, he'll try to take action in Congress, and that could hurt the league's bottom line. Officials say since 2014, at least 27 NFL players have been accused of committing some form of violence or harassment against women, and at least seven remain part of an NFL organization this season. Blumenthal says if the NFL fails to take effective action, he will try to end their permanent antitrust exemption, which has provided financial support and benefits to the league since 1961. Years ago, the NFL promised new accountability measures following Following domestic violence. They said independent investigations, stronger discipline, and counseling would come for players involved. Recently, Kansas City Chiefs player Kareem Hunt was under fire after a video released of him allegedly attacking a woman outside a hotel. And linebacker Reuben Foster was released by the San Francisco 49ers following a domestic violence arrest, but was immediately picked up by the Washington Redskins. So Blumenthal will be meeting with the Connecticut Coalition Against Domestic Violence and also the Interval House today. That meeting's at 1230. We're live in Hartford, Caitlin Nuclear Channel 3 Eyewitness News.